Hi, I'm back at my campsite again. I want to try out an all night fire system again today. Today I'm going to be doing the long log fire. I did another one earlier about the self-feeding system and today I want to try out something else. Uh, let's get started. With the log fire you only need uh, three pieces of wood. They're about four feet long and then roughly six to eight inches in diameter. This is all white ash. It's been, this tree has been dead for quite a while, but it's been standing up. I chipped some of the bark off because it's actually pretty wet. You know, I left the, the gap between the two logs. That is where you start your initial fire. You just fill it with tinder, get a fire started, and the third log ends up going on top between the two logs. And that's why those stones are there, just to keep the logs from rolling outwards once that log drops in. So the key is going to be getting the initial fire going. Well, it's time to get a fire going. Okay, we'll let that burn for a while, then we'll add the top log. Okay, I got a pretty good fire going between the logs. I think I'm going to try adding the top log now. First thing I'm going to do is I add a couple of stakes on either end. So keep that top log just above the logs a little bit so you get some more air flow through there. Eventually those stakes will burn through anyway and then the log will just drop down. Just keep feeding that fire in there in between the two logs for a while. Once that top log starts uh, burning too, it should keep going by itself. Okay, it's been a little over an hour now since I started the fire. The stakes have burnt through and the top log has fallen down. 
There's still lots of airflow in there and a nice fire going on, so it looks pretty good so far. Well, it's been about three hours now, almost three hours. It's still burning the way I think it should, and it looks good so far. Past the three hour mark here, and the uh, bottom or the top log is actually is falling down between the other two logs, so it's still burning pretty good. The top middle log is almost completely burned now, so I moved the two side logs closer together, and it's starting to burn again. It's almost five hours now. Well, it's been burning for almost uh, five, five, six hours now. It worked out pretty good. About an hour ago, um, that top log had completely burned through. So I just moved the two outer logs in a bit. And that actually worked pretty good. But I think the next time I'll simply add another log on top and it'll burn even longer. I was uh, a little skeptical at first how well it worked, but it actually works pretty good. Um, you could use larger diameter logs, I guess, if, and then the fire would last even longer. I don't think it's such a bad thing if you have to get up you know, around 3, 4 o'clock in the morning and have to throw another log or two pieces of a log on top to get you to last all the way to the morning. It's not like uh, most people sleep through the night anyway. So actually it worked pretty good. Quite pleased.